Hey guys, welcome back. And for this combo, you're gonna need lightning strike level three, web shot level three, and support attacks such as ice shards and spectral arrow. And I'll see you later. Now I'm pretty sure your mind plexes already know about this combo. You use web shot, then followed by lightning. Bam! And then you spell all your other spells such as spectral arrow, fireball, mana bolt, rainbow beam. I don't know. Um. The reason why this class is so effective, or combo, excuse me, this is so effective is because the web shot immobilizes them. And because it's such a short cooldown, they, the enemy can't get away more than three times, at most. Because they can use flash or fireball, but within that time, you, you still have a shorter cooldown. So therefore, you have more of a chance to trap them again, and again, and again. Now some people suggest that Rumble is better than Lightning Strike, or you, you can even use a combo, but I prefer using Lightning Strike first because of the Afterburner damage, as well as the immediate shock damage that the user receives, not the user, the enemy. Blech. For example, in this situation, I think you will have a more higher chance of hitting him with Lightning instead of Rumble. You see what I mean? Lightning, they don't even stand a chance because it's a um, vertical shot. Now if you're ever entangled in this combo, there's only a few ways you can get out. One is flash, just like the enemy just used. Two is fireball. Fireball will destroy the combos around you. And three is rumble, which is highly unlikely because you have to activate on the ground. And like web shot, you can't really look at the ground. Because you'd be looking at the transparent block, which is the cobweb in this case. I recommend using this combo when your lightning strike and your web shot are both level 2 and up. Because level 1, first of all, it won't do that much damage. Web shot, it only flings out 2 webs, so you really don't have much of an opportunity to entangle someone in that combo. Now I recommend using spectral arrow and um, ice shards as your follow up weapon is because rainbow beam and mana bolt won't actually go through the web block. It really won't, so I'm that's why I'm recommending ice shards and spectral arrow because it will actually go through the web and hit the user. Not the user, the enemy! Why am I doing this? <laughs> so thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys think the combo is um, effective when you play, please let me know in the comments below. And yeah, that's really it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.